Today we are going to make sweet red bean mochi soup. Let's get to it! Aloha! Welcome to Kensho Quest, where a world schooling family unexpectedly under self quarantine in Northern California. Please subscribe to follow our adventures moving off grid. And give us some thumbs up! Today, we're going to make a traditional Japanese dessert that your mom and I used to have when we were kids. When we were your age, we used to make this. Our mom taught us how to make this. And this is what we actually ate as our number one dessert at home. I have a question. Yes. Are these beans? Those are beans. So what do you think is those are that's all we need other than water. That's all we need. So what what do we have there? Um we have some beans. I think they're azuki beans. Okay? You're right. You want to show me? Okay. Right. Those are azuki beans. What else do we have? I don't know what this is called, but I just get so I'll call I'll just call it mochi ball flour. <laughs> what do you think? Well, give it to Mia and let's see if Mia can tell you what it says on it. Gluten free gluten. <laughs> it's a complicated rice word. Flour. Yes, glutinous free rice glutinous rice flour. Basically, rice flour. Rice flour. Yes, like mochi flour. Okay. Mm -hmm. And what's the other ingredient we have there? Oh, sugar. Sugar. <laughs> First thing we need to do is when you're making beans, is we're supposed to soak them. But we didn't do that because we want to eat these today, so we're just going to cook them on a higher heat, all right? So what we're going to do now is we're going to wash the beans first in this bowl of water here. So can someone pour okay. one cup of beans into the bowl? Oops. <laughs> oh, that's kind of hard, Otter. I don't think you want to eat a solid bean. Okay, one cup, please. Okay. And then just kind of swish it around with your hand. Make it. Yes, like that. Let me help you out there. That's there good. you go, Hunter. Okay, swish it around. That's good. We're just kind of washing the beans right now, okay? It's like washing rice. That's right. Rice. Kaisho's a pro at that. <laughs> Aru, <laughs> Aru, uh, at... yes, Let's pour them all in there. This is going to take a couple of hours at least. Do you know why we are making this dessert today? Um, so Baba and Dada can eat it. <laughs> mm, yeah, that's true. Why else? Because you made it when you were little. That's true too, but why else? Any other ideas why? Um, let me think. Because it's yummy. Very good, that's true too. So the main reason why we are making this and why I'm having you guys make it is because it's part of your heritage. What's heritage? It means that's where your family comes from. Do you know what nationality you guys are? I'll let Mia go first. Japanese. That's right. You're, you're part Japanese, huh? Do you know how much Japanese you are? A quarter. Very well said. What else are you? That, sorry, that's Haru again. <laughs> Haru, just wait a Okay, go ahead, Mia. Filipino. Wow, very good. What else? You do not remember. Well, there's some, there's some uh, Caucasian in you, which is a very mixed, um, a bunch of mixed races in your part. 
So, Kaisho, you were also have quarter Japanese, quarter Filipino, and a bunch of other stuff. And, and Haru's bumping me from back. That's why the camera's shaking. Sorry. Uh, <laughs> this crazy little... Oh, there she goes. Anyway, she keeps bumping into me, and she's making it very difficult for us to film. There she is. What is it? Making a dessert that's from there have to do with it. It helps you understand, like, where some of your family comes from. It's very important to know that you have many different cultures in you, many different nationalities, and you are part of a melting pot. Or, as they say in India, mixed vegetables. And I'm being pushed again by Haru. Do you get it? Mixed vegetables? That means that, like, you, you're made of all kinds of things. Like carrots and cabbage and potatoes. No. <laughs> no, 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 that's not it. Yes, and adzuki beans. It's been a half an hour. We're gonna check the beans. I know they're not ready yet, but everybody be safe, okay? Stay right where you are. I'm gonna take this off and I'm gonna show you. You can see, can you guys see it's boiling? Mm -hmm. The beans look pretty good now. But look, you see that? I don't know if you can hear that, but see, they're still, they're still pretty hard. Can you see that, Mia? They're just a little hard. Yeah, well, we want them to be soft. Really? Yeah, pretty soft. And basically what's going to happen is the they skin on these. They did. You're right. They got bigger. So you need to add more water in there. The kids are busy playing, so I'm going to add some sugar to the beans because it's almost done. It's been about an hour and a half. Kaisho, can you take two scoops? There's a spoon in there already. Two scoops of sugar of the brown sugar and put it in with the flour. Two four scoops? Yes, but not gigantic scoops. That's our... <laughs> okay, that's one. And we would usually use white sugar, but since we don't have any, we're gonna use brown sugar, so that's fine, that's fine. It's just gonna be a little sweet, that's fine. Okay, you put the spoon back in there, Kaisha. All right, Mia, no, Mia, Mia, before we do that, we, I need you to mix those two ingredients. Yeah, okay. Yes, yeah. what we wanna do is make sure we mix the dry ingredients really well first. Do that. Okay. Oh, you're gonna start mixing it? <laughs> okay, mix, 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 Kasha. Should I do it? So I can do it a little bit faster. Can I do it? It looks kind of dry, huh? I don't even see how dough would make a squishy ball. <laughs> I think it's time for you guys to get your hands dirty. Use your hands now. So now what you want to do is make little balls about this big, okay? So make, start making... <laughs> That's too... Oh no. You know what? I think it's too liquidy. We're going to have to add some more dough. Hold on, let me get some more uh, flour. Hold on. It's too sticky. Too sticky. Too much liquid. All right, let me get some more flour. Yeah. This is like mixing chocolate. Bossy. But now it feels good. Now it feels perfect. It does feel perfect. It looks perfect too. Very good. Okay, I'm gonna show you one thing. After you guys make the ball, what you wanna do is you wanna take your finger Okay, and you want to stick it in the middle and make a little divot in there like that, okay? Why? The, the reason for that is it's just like when you make burgers, you put a divot into it and that's what helps keep the shape. Well, that's a tiny one, Kaisha, but I guess that's okay. That's a Haru size one, all right? Oh my God, what is a Haru size one? All right, there, you guys are doing great. See, you're learning about your culture. You're seriously gonna make the soup and then you're gonna put them in here as dough? That's right. You'll Is see. Is this a good ball? Yes, it's perfect, Mia. Well, it's a Mia size ball. It's a Mia size ball, yes. Perfect, you guys. They're looking great. <laughs> <laughs> that's a big oh, that's size. a big one. That's a big one. That's the biggest multi ball I've ever seen. <laughs> Read them apart. Has it already been eight hours? <laughs> no, but it's been two and a half. 
And the beans are ready. We'll see you in a minute. 39. Looks great. Where's Miss 40? Isn't this such a great project for you guys? Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, that's fun. Well, that's the most important part. Forty! Forty! Oh my god! Forty-one! <laughs> we made forty-one! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. 19, 20. No. <laughs> you recounted. <laughs> Wait, what? To me it looks like chocolate. Does it look like chocolate? Like, it does. Okay, don't it get your hands like too close. Melted special. chocolate with marshmallows in it. With marshmallows? Yeah. Actually, it looks like hot chocolate now. With marshmallows. Mm -hmm. The big, really, 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 really big marshmallows. How many did you put in? Who knows? I think it tastes like coconut. You think it's gonna taste like coconut? Yes. What about you, Kaisho? Mm -hmm. I, I, I think it's gonna taste weird. You think it's gonna taste weird? <laughs> uh oh. What about, uh oh, what do you think, Haru? Gunk. <laughs> it will taste, Haru thinks it will taste like gunk or yogurt. Well, you guys, what do you think of your creation here? It's your first for time? Now, give me. Anybody want to take a guess on what you call it in Japanese? Mm. I know this is not it, but Taifuku. Daifuku? I think you're pretty close, Kaisho. So it is mochi's part of the name. And the reason why is because we're using mochi flour. We don't have the right exact type of flour. So this is called mochi zenzai. Okay. Also known as sweet red boon. <laughs> red boon. <laughs> <laughs> Sweet uh, red bean uh, soup. Okay, itadakimasu. Okay. Go ahead, Haru. I don't know what this is going to taste like, but here we go. <laughs> no. It was too hot. Here we go. Too hot. Oops, sorry. Okay, I'm going to put this in the oven. Okay. Let's see how it tastes. Look at those expressions. <laughs> They're speechless. It tastes like bean flour. Like bean flour? Oh. Interesting. <laughs> what is even? What is with the bean? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. It tastes like flour with beans. Flour with beans. Interesting. Okay. Kaisho, how about you? I don't know what it tastes like. Okay, how do how do go ahead? Goes off. Okay. All right, Haru, go ahead. Let us know. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna try a big mochi ball. Here. Okay. I mean, they look like bananas. <laughs> but they just taste like flour. Mm, the mochi balls are good. The mochi balls are good? Mm hmm But when you try it with beans, they don't have a flavor. Oh, really? Maybe we didn't put enough flavor in it. Haru, you can try it? No. No? <laughs> I'm just gonna... Okay. I'm just gonna try this tiny mochi ball. All right. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Give us some thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe. <laughs> Thanks for playing, you guys.